Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be taking my canes that I made, I think what, a week ago or so. And we're going to be making diamond painting pens. Yay. So I'm going to turn everybody around. I'm going to time lapse the video, play some music while I make some pins. And we'll get to see what they all look like. Everybody ready?
in our hearts I said, hey, yeah, yeah, yeah Follow the spark Ain't nothing but a Kiss the past goodbye I'm longing to live this Free life I've been hearing about You will see us howling Like wolves in the night Cause nothing is stronger Than wanting what you might get I said hey, yeah, yeah, yeah
Hi everybody and welcome back. I hope everybody enjoyed the video. So here we have all the pins that I made. So aren't they lovely? They turn out really, really nice. Yeah, so there we have, let's see how many we have. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 10, 11, 12. We have 12 of them. I did make a couple cover minders to match, but the square ones are a little, a little too thin, they're a little flimsy. So maybe if I'm gonna try to glaze them and maybe harden them up a little bit but yes here we have our 12 pins that I made out of all those canes that I made about a week ago or so ago so I hope everybody did enjoy the video and thank you everybody for coming back and seeing my project so here we have, I'm going to get everybody a little bit closer to we can take a closer look. So here we have, there's this one. Now this one was made with, uh, let me think, which one was this? This is the one that I made when Tia was on the live. This is with Primo, Sculpey Primo. I made this one with Tia when she were on live last week. I made three of them. Then, oh, I made four of them. Here's another one. Then this is the cane from the Kato. Turned out very, very nice. I did end up reducing this down to three times the size of the cane that I had. So, and as you can see, it did not distort hardly. I don't think it distorted at all. It cut very, very nice. Yeah, so I'm really impressed with the Kato. The Kato is a much stiffer clay. So yeah, I did get a, my fingers did get a workout. And so these ones, this is a, a, a thick, a thicker pen. This is the regular size pen. So I made these out of the cane. Uh, I also, these are the two that I made in the video when I made the canes. Um, I do believe it is the Primo. Uh, this now these four are made with the Sculpey three. I went ahead and reduced it down a little, a tiny, tiny, tiny bit more, and got a pretty nice design out of it still. As you can see they all pretty much. A little bit different. This has gold in it. The gold uh, clay. And this one back here has the blue. This is the galaxy blue. It has the uh, the sparkle glitter in the in the in the clay. Yeah, so that turned out really, really nice. I did really like this one. It turned out really, really nice. I love the Kato, how it turned out. It turned out really, really well. So, yeah. So, there are my 12 pens that I made. These are the cover minders from the Kato. They're really, really thin, so I'm not sure if I'm going to... I'm just, I'm just going to finish them and see how they turn out because they are very, very thin. So this one's kind of, you can see it's kind of bent a little bit. So 
maybe if I get some hardener on there, it'll harden back up. So these were just, I just threw in there just because I knew they were going to be too, too thin, but, um, we'll see how, how they finish up. I still have to sand and glaze them. So this week I do have my three days off this week. So I'll have some time to get these sanded glazed for Friday and maybe make some more clay. Um, I do have some Kato left and I have, I do have an idea for my Kato. Yeah, so that's coming up. I'm going to give a new different type of cane a try um, and see how it turns out. So I thank everybody for stopping by and I hope everybody enjoyed the video. Bye guys.